Hello, loving greetings to you. This is Paul Friedman at the Marriage Foundation. I'm the founder, actually. And if you're here for the first time, a special welcome to you. I'm sorry you have to find us with this uh, kind of video where signs marriage is over after infidelity. And this is strictly for you. I can help you. I've been doing this since 2001. I used to be a divorce mediator, so I've seen the other side where the marriage has imploded, exploded, ended. But in this case, I want you to know that all of the odds are on your side when you know what to do. Now, as a divorce mediator, I met very nice people who just couldn't be married anymore. And there was infidelity. I've had cases where the men were chronic and cases where the men cheated with the wife's best friend. So common, it was ridiculous. And I did this for eight years before developing our courses that we now have online and you can get one and you really should get the course for women because what brought your marriage to your husband's infidelity are conditions that can be changed by you changing yourself. And I'm not blaming you for your husband's infidelity, not at all. And it is on him and it will be on him to have to atone for those sins. However, what you can do to change the dynamic of your marriage is so incredibly powerful. I've discovered this through the years more and more, how much power you as a woman has with her man and how through, and I'll just be honest with you, through over familiarity, by getting used to your husband, taking him for granted, not opening your heart fully to him in ways where he understood it, and instead getting into the mode of day-to-day -day, uh, bickering and arguing and disputing and criticizing him. It just really brought him to the point of where he wanted an out. He wanted what you originally provided to him. You provided to him love like he'd never experienced before. Remember when you guys first met? That experience of soulmates coming together, that explosion in your heart, that awareness that you found the one, but then what happened over time was that you got used to him. He got used to you. And together you turn into cellmates instead of soulmates. What you can do now is you can turn it around. The number one sign that you can turn this around is that you still love him. You still want to be married to him. You still want to travel to the end of your lives together. You want to have what you should have. And in fact, it would be a crying shame if you were to look at any other potential sign that it won't work short of he's living with someone else, he moved out and you don't speak to each other anymore. But except for those, you can bring your marriage back together. And we're here to help you with that. I'm gonna leave in the description a link to reviews that were given by people who have gone through what you're going through. And recognize that Contrary to what is taught in our world right now, you have everything in your favor. By the way, please subscribe 
we want to reach so many people and the more people who subscribe and we've got a lot of subscribers of getting close to 90,000 and we'd also like you to like the video I say we I'm there are, uh, there's a team here but I want you to so please like the video and leave a comment tell me you're encouraged you're going to try this course for women and you're going to get your marriage back. You're going to get the love of your life back. God bless you. Uh, and please take care. And don't give up. Don't give up.